Ah. Hey. How are y'all doing? Yikes! I'm just a burnt out middle school math teacher that has always felt like an outsider in this world. I was looking forward to a nice vacation connecting with my guildmates and excited to attend my first Comic Con on Deer Isle. Yet, fate took an unexpected turn, thrusting me into the chaos of a world gone mad. Amidst the relentless threat and the brutal decree of survival, I am confronted with the harsh reality adapt or perish. Okay, welcome back to the story of Ollie. This is our main character, Oliver. We last left off. We went all the way to the East Harbor, got in a gunfight, survived the gunfight, but then died to some infected. So now we are a fresh spawn all over again with poor Ollie here. All right, so we're going to uh, have to loot. Looks like I'm near an area right over here. So let's see what we have. I think the sun is coming up, if I am correct. So, which is good, because I'm not a big fan of playing at nighttime. It is hard to see in the dark. All right, well, they start us off with a knife, which is great. So, let's see. What am I doing? That was a weird way to climb. Oh, man, Oliver's drunk already. All right, nothing in there. Okay, is this like, a, I guess, a harbor? I mean, I say it's a harbor and there's a boat there. But I mean, is it looks industrial connected to a harbor? Don't know. Someone has been here and they've dumped their sling bag. So this server starts you out with a bag, gives you some water. Oh, look, I even got a pear. That's nice. And this one has uh, unlimited sprint, which is great for getting around the map fast. Is that military area right here or is that a garage? Garage. Saw. Well, we can use the saw to cut people. Looks like I need some better clothes. Can you find some good clothes in this kind of area? I don't know that you can. Gunfire behind me. All these doors are open. I'm assuming someone has already been here. I'm going to take this. I'm going to keep the can opener. Use the saw. Let's run to the gunfire. Let's make some gloves. Always start off with knife and gloves. And since I don't have to find a knife, I should be good. So how is everyone doing today? I hope your day is going good. There is a player. He's got a baseball bat. And I have a saw. We can try to talk to him. Or we can go try to saw him to death. Bunch of slings. This is a spawn area. So looks like we're going to see. 
bunch of spawn stuff here. I think I could use a better melee weapon than a knife and a saw. And I don't want no going. I don't want to go in that boat. I get lost going in the boats. I don't care about a walkie. Don't care about that right now either. All right, which way did that guy go? I don't want to follow behind him because, I mean, he's just going to loot everything. How about a giant pink coat to make me stand out? Keep me warm. I think I will stand out a little bit. All right, I'm cutting through the woods. We'll see which way that gunfire is going. See if we can get an idea of where we're at. Because um, I don't think, they don't give you a map, or they do, do they? Yeah, this one gives you a map. Okay. Is that military? Yep. That's probably where all the gunfire is coming from. That's so close to a spawn area. And I don't have anything. So I am going to choose not to go to that. Because I think it would be death. I think that's... Uh, let me look on the map real quick. Tell you what I think that might be. Yep. This even tells you where you're at. Okay, so I know exactly where I'm at. That's Camp Eagle. I have been there. And it is got some good military stuff. Way up here is the East Harbor. Way up there. So, we can risk it and go for Camp Eagle. But, man, I don't know. I don't have anything. Maybe I can grab a gun and then fight. We'll run through this tree line here and see what we can do. Okay. It's a guard shack. And there's some barracks. We'll start with the guard check. Change out those pathetic pants for at least these pants. Think anything's in these towers? I should go for the barracks. Look at that. We got chicken bones. I'll use that in case I need to make a fire.
So someone's no telling how many people are here. No telling how many are here. Look at all those dead zombies. Ah! Hey! Hey, I don't have nothing. Don't kill me. Yikes! Oh, you hit me through the door, you jerk. Got two bleeds from that zombie. Are these zombies like... Gear... These got zombies like... Extra strong or something? There's nothing here. This is like, is this like a medical? Or... Okay, I'm going to go after him with a knife. Can I get out the other side over here? No. I wonder if the guy that was, uh, that had all those zombies stacked up that I was trying to take a screenshot of, was he in that police check or guard check? Boy, why does he sound so loud for? Am I making so much noise that he just wants to run to me? No idea where the player went to. I just ran. Well, I really have nothing to lose, so let's run to the tent. Put this hat on. Now I look cool. I can die in style. Okay, one infected over there. This area is all looted out. Let's go try to find something that's actually useful.
get to the safety of the tree line and then I'm going to see which way we're going to head. Alright, so let's check out this deer stand. Hopefully it has something good. Let's see. I'll eat it. It ain't nothing bad. I need to go ahead and take a swig of water here. Alright. What is this big tower? Anything good? Just looks like some garages. Giant sledgehammer. I'll take an extra cleaver just in case. Someone's been here. Hey, look. 22 ammo. Found my first ammo. Alright, so I want to go straight north and go to Oceanville. Another saw. I have a saw. Frying pan, raincoat, a rider jacket. Is that more camouflage than what I have? If not, I look cooler. That's all that matters. Why is it not transferring over? Come on. Let's see if we see any movement at all. Do not. Love the way that water sounds when it's like I don't even know what you call that the ambient noise of the water washing the waves washing up. Um jeans medium insulation. That's actually more camouflage, isn't it? Because I'm green running in the forest. Let's instead of the blue, let's go with the green. It's better camouflage. Okay, there's a police station, which clearly is, people are going to go to that. There's a player over there. He's got a fresh spawn shirt on.
Go talk to him. Oh, wait, did I look right here? Did I look on the inside of this little bench? No, nothing there. Hunting rifle. Ooh, I was just joking, but look. Hello. 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 How's it going? Hello. Hello. Hey, I'm fresh. All I have is a, a knife. Hey, how's it going? How's it going? What you? You got. You, you got anything good? I just spawned in. I'm here. Waiting for my friend. All right. Uh, hey, do you want to go to the police station together and work as a team of two just to get through the police station? Uh. Maybe not. Are you in the police station? <laughs> Maybe that's not good. I was talking too loud. Hello, survivor. Is anyone in the police station? Is anyone in the police station? Yes. Do you have any loot that you can share? Yes, that is nothing. Oh, I see. Hey, how's it going? Hey, how are y'all doing? Yikes! Oh, what happened? I got kicked off the game. Uh, you were kicked for the game. Admin kick. Server restart? Well, maybe that saved my life. Do you think it saved my life or he, he cut me once there were two on the top and I don't know where he came from. Um, so I would either be like dead or I'll be bleeding. Looks like I survived. I got a Winchester, right? Let's get out of here. Let's go get loot. Let's go find some ammo for this gun. That guy was coming at me with a knife. He got me right one hit before... Or the server restart. Well, these guys are fast, aren't they? Me some ammo in here. Okay, so I was watching this one guy who did a really good tutorial. Sorry, I don't, can't give you credit. I forgot the name. But he says, come, when you have zombies, come over here. And they're going to come to the side of the house that you, you're on, right? And then you can run out the other side. It gives you a little buffer. 
Like, see, here's there's one right there. I don't know where the other one's at. There they are. Okay, so we have two right here coming to this side of the house. Now, what I want to do is run out. Oh, no, there's one right there. It did give me a buffer, though. Will they can I don't know where they continue to follow me. Okay, so we we got a, a Winchester. Someone came at us. There was like three or four people at that police station. Came at us with a knife. Got one slice. Server restart. And I ran out of there because I have a Winchester. So, I want to get some ammo for it. Oh, very nice. You can keep that. You are now my number one melee weapon. All right, we're going to put Winchester number one. We'll put axe number two. We'll put the knife number three. People seem to be kind of ornery today. Got to get my cowboy hat on. All right. Where is the best place to get 308? I feel like I can find 308 in deer stands. And where else can you find 308? Oceanville is straight north is Oceanville. What if I go north west? <laughs> oh no. It looks better with my black jacket that is damaged. 308, come on. Do I have one in the chamber? Don't they do that now? Nope, they don't even have one. Nine by 19, and I got 22 rounds. No 308, though. Look at that. Another Winchester. And I do have some bullets in this one. Okay. Rocking two Tundras. Rocking two tundras. Let's go to this tower and then through the woods. I want to see if I find any deer stands along the way. Maybe if we can get a scope.
This one's worn. They're both worn. Now I got me a revolver, 357, even though I do not have any 357 rounds. That's nice. Okay, if you do find stuff in these destroyed things, where where would you find it? Where's the best chance of finding it? Up top? Can of food. Maybe I should climb to the tower and snipe. I don't have a scope though. This, this ain't the one I just went into, is it? Okay. So Oceanville is to my right. I'm going to cut through the woods and go west. I'm going to take the scenic route west and see if uh, I can find a deer stand or two. Doesn't that look like a bush that you can cut down? Okay, here we go. I think this is one. I'm trying to make me a bigger, uh, Backpacks, what I'm working on. Okay, so what I got to do is I got to empty this out. Oh, I didn't know I was carrying that stupid helmet. Okay, now, can this one, oh, can the axe fit? Yes, so the axe can fit, so I can carry, let's see. Okay, Ollie's got a bigger backpack now. Dual carrying Winchesters. All right, I feel a little better. A little better about that. Did I go in that house? I think I did.
Come on, give me some 308. Other, I mean, more than what I have. Crowbar? I have an axe. I don't need a crowbar. Where is that coming from? Camp Bear. That's where that's coming from. Let's head to Camp Bear. It's going to be to our west. Still wish I could find a scope. <laughs> ah, this is the house I'm used to that has two doors. Here's where all the action's coming from. But I have three shots. I don't, I don't think I'm really equipped to fight. But if I can get one good shot on somebody that has loot. That would be great. Man, I was really hoping I'd find some 308. Take some food. I do have something to make fire. I'm getting rid of this saw. Saul is useless to me. I'm going to put my ammo in my jeans. I usually put my food on this side. It's funny how you get, you get used to doing things a certain way. Like, I always put my food here my water next to it and I put my bandages and stuff over here because I want to be able to get to those quick and I'll put 
I don't know why I've got this rag other than to make a fire. I'm going to keep my ammo over there with my revolver. Got four shots. That's nice. Oh, the backpack is a little bigger than I thought it was. All right. Sorry, make it, I'm sorry. I promised you I wouldn't make you watch me do inventory management, and I just did. My bad. Okay, I'm gonna have to call this episode right here. We'll hang out here, and then we'll go to the camp. What did I call that? Is Camp Bear? What is that camp called again? Yeah, we're right here on the edge of Camp Bear. We'll head into there and check it out on the next episode of The Story of Ollie. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, and get notified.